Hi, I'm Ethan Rowan from the Tufts Medical Center Hypertrophic Cardiomyopathy Clinic. We'll be discussing a study recently published in JAMA Cardiology, which looked at the outcomes after surgical myectomy or alcohol septal ablation, two procedures using obstructive HCM, which looked at outcomes using a nationwide inpatient database and clearly demonstrated a huge discrepancy between outcomes in patients undergoing these procedures in an inexperienced center. When looking at alcohol septal ablation, there was a significant decrease in both procedural morbidity and mortality when comparing outcomes in the top versus the bottom third of centers based on procedural experience. These findings are even more pronounced when examining surgical myectomy with mortality rates of over 15% in inexperienced centers. However, mortality rates were also unacceptably high, almost 4%, even in the top third of centers. In sharp contrast, past data from HCM centers of excellence demonstrate that mortality rates should be under 1%, at least four times lower than this top third. This makes a clear case that these procedures should ideally be performed in these centers of excellence, like the Tufts Medical Center, HCM Center, where they are performed at the highest level with a multidisciplinary team of world experts and the lowest morbidity and mortality rates and improved patient outcomes 